So are you on Tinder or Bumble or Grindr or like any of the dating apps on your phone? If you are, I'm sure you've come across some like really awkward or weird people. If that's true, I want to see the screenshot. Send them to me. It'll be fully anonymous. I won't say your name. I won't even say their name. I'll block everything out. Sure. But send them over. Uh, I'm going to share mine right now, but I want to see yours too. Oh, okay. CK's kind of cute. I like those sunglasses. Oh my gosh. That hair to that underwear to that ass to the f- <laughs> to the fact that she's possibly holding a gun. I'm in. Sometimes just a good bio can help get you matches. And I love this bio. So I'm just going to read the very first line. I'm a fatty and 5'10". I have eight tarantulas. Hey guys, I'm Emma. You probably recognize me from my role as Doc on Snow White. I will kill you. But also looking for love. (laughs) Okay, tell me Belle's work bitch hat doesn't look like it's photoshopped on her head. All right, Carol looks so sweet and like she would make a hella good cookie. But sweetheart, you're not 23. (laughs) Hi, hi guys, I'm Allie. Um, Can someone help? Also, a huge key to getting matches is like getting your best and most flattering angles in your pictures. Like this, looking right down Main Street. Yes, girl, love the confidence. Like Rebecca, confidence is key on these dating apps. But sometimes you really got to throw yourself out there like Crystal. Crystal is bi. She hates one-way conversations. She's given her full name to look her up on Facebook and her phone number. Crystal is not here to play games, and I'm into it. Hey, guys, I'm Morgan, and when I'm not dressing up like a wax doll, I work at Best Buy. (laughs) I'm sure this turns some guys on, but to me, I'm just like, are you okay? Okay, Heather is actually pretty cute. But she's making a face that, like, reminds me of the face you would make if you, like, watched somebody bite into a string cheese. Hey, y'all, I want you to meet my girlfriend. Successful. Damn, Isabella, you a thick Latina. All right, let's see another picture. Oh, you, uh, you don't look as thick or as Latina. Okay, these last three are sexual. So here's my warning, but it is tender. You're going to run across these sometimes. Yes, Michaela's titties are for real showing. I block them because this is Instagram, not Pornhub. There they are, my favorite screenshots from my Tinder. And I know that there's going to be people out there offended over this video. Take it easy, okay? Take it easy. And send me your favorite screenshots from your Tinder. Uh, fully anonymous, okay? I'm not going to put you on blast. <laughs> Okay, guys, Uh, update, I've received gold from you guys, so that's coming. Also, a couple of, did you hear my stomach just now? (laughs) I guess I'm hungry. Okay, I've received awesome things from you guys, and that's coming. Um, But also, I got a few things flagged, so if you're the one that flagged me for sexuality, enjoy the humor! I am Josh. Business in the front, yogi in the back. Namaste. Now here's someone your mom would actually love. Yeah, I'm Boston. Uh, if you don't like my tractor or my dog, then you can F off. Also, if you act stupid, I'm going to treat you stupid. Uh, swipe right. Yeah, I'm man deep and I always get stopped at the airport. Because of these guns. Honestly, I look at pictures of these and I'm like, who took this for you? Oh my gosh, Jim is someone's grandpa. Read his bio. I'm not even going to say it. (laughs) I think that's just a ham. I I don't even, I don't know what to say with it. Honestly, I don't even know if I can post this, but I'm scared. (laughs) All right, we're here living in 2019. Curtis is living in like 4,019. Dude made a PowerPoint. That's how you sell yourself, Curtis.